All right, so it's pretty transparent that people actually start to feel that skins do give them aimbot. It's a pretty transparent trend that has been going on for the past months now. And I have to say, I'm someone that also has the feeling that a skin does improve my gameplay. Now, whether that's true or not, it's actually pretty simple. Do skins give me an aimbot? Do they increase anything about the way the gun plays in terms of stats? And the short answer is obviously no. They factually do not change anything about the gun. Whether it's the Randall or the Phantom, skins do not change anything about the gun factually. In terms of stats, everything stays the same. So why is it that the majority of people still say that they have an aimbot and that they play better with specific skins. Because it is true, skins actually do improve gameplay for most of the people. Even if it factually doesn't change anything, it still improves their gameplay. And in this video, we're gonna break down exactly why that is. And as always, I do hope you guys enjoy the video. So as I told you guys before, skins factually don't change anything about how a gun is being played in terms of changing the statistics of a gun, for example. It doesn't change the fire speed, it doesn't change the reload animation, it doesn't really change anything at all other than you having a nice looking gun. And to show you guys exactly what I mean, I went into the practice area and compared a default skin to a prime skin, for example, or a Reva skin or a iron skin, just so you guys get a better understanding. So as you obviously just saw, nothing about these guns changes at all. Whether you have a skin or not, everything just stays the same. The reload time, the spray, all of these stats that you see right here, they won't change at all, whether you have a skin or not. But there's one huge thing that people don't necessarily take into account when looking at these comparisons and just looking at the skins at all. It's something that you can only realize when you play with these skins. And this is the biggest factor as to why skins make you play so much better than just default weapons. It is the way they feel and sound in game which makes them so much better than just using a default vandal for example or a skin without any sound or visual effects. Because that's the main reason so many people are in love with these whole skin collections like the Prime collection or the Reaver collection or the Oni collection for example. It's because of these sound effects and the visual effects that you get with these skins. And obviously we do have many other skins like the Rush skins or the Avalanche skins or the Lux skins for example. But there is one huge reason as to why people don't play these as much as they play Prime skins or Reaver skins. And that's just the fact that these collections just lack effects. They lack sound effects, they lack visual effects which makes them way less interesting than the other skins because yeah, it's literally just a visual upgrade but not really an upgrade in terms of how the gun plays in game, how it feels. And this is the main point. Skins like the Elder Flame Vandal for example or the Sovereign Ghost or the Prime Vandal or the Reaver Vandal, like everything that comes with sound effects, it just feels so smooth most of the time, especially with the Iron skins and the Prime skins. Like shooting with the Prime Vandal is 
not comparable to anything else in this game. It just feels so crisp and satisfying when shooting this weapon because of the changes to its sound and to the visuals. And as I just said, the same thing is happening on the Iron Skins, for example, where it also just feels so crisp and clean when shooting. Same thing goes for the Elder Flame as well and the Reaver Skins. Everything with the sound effect just feels different most of the time. Obviously, you have to try them out yourself. Some people prefer the Reaver Vandal way more than the Prime Vandal and some people prefer the Prime Vandal way more than the Reaver Vandal. Which also goes to show that there isn't like one specific rule that says if you have a skin with sound effects you're gonna have an improvement in game. Everybody is different and everybody has a different perception of how one skin feels over another. But in general sound effects do improve gameplay and this isn't like the golden rule some people even prefer just default skins but the majority of people prefer when it has sound effects and visual effects and most of the time it really does give you an improvement in game so yeah it would really be interesting to see what you guys think about this whole topic let me know in the comments down below if you actually prefer having skin with sound effects if they do help you to play in game or if you just don't care at all and none of this stuff affects you in game. Either way, let me know in the comments down below. Make sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe if you like the content and as always guys, I see you on the next one.